What did you guys have for lunch today? I'm getting kind of hungry. I'm Colleen, and you can call me your pivot. The other day, while walking back to work from getting lunch, I bumped into this really cute guy. And he didn't waste time to get a good conversation started. His approach was commenting on how close our workplaces were to each other and asking if I were getting bored eating the same lunch every day. And bless his little heart, I could tell he was super nervous and trying to act cool at the same time. But I really liked talking to him because he didn't right off the bat state the obvious and ask where I was from. And he asked uncommon questions, questions that had me thinking. But what kind of turned me off is that once we got to talking a little bit more, he started agreeing to everything I was saying. It's like he didn't have his own bloody opinion, wasn't comfortable with who he is, and he would say anything, even lie, to make me like him. It was really annoying, and dude, you don't have to lie to kick it. Have you ever eaten at Mama C's? Yeah, their sandwiches are pretty bomb. Me and my boys hit up that spot on Saturdays after we surf. Oh, nice. I don't know about that place. I didn't really quite enjoy their food, and it took way too long for them to bring it out. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not really the best spot to sit down and eat. Well, I take it back. I can't talk too much crap about Mama C's because their burgers are way better than the ones at Sammy's Joint. Yeah, yeah, you are right. Mama C's burgers are better than, than Sammy's Joint. Yeah. Boys, if you find yourself doing that, I want you to stop. You need to have your own opinions, and I know you all do. So don't be afraid to speak up and say, mm, I kind of see it differently. Not really liking your taste in food, but I won't judge you on that. You know what? Later on when you do go to compliment her, she's going to believe you. Because so far you've proven to her that you're an honest, outspoken guy. Hey, brownie points for you guys. So boys, what's your opinion on your opinion? And uh, don't forget to rate and subscribe. I'm just making sure if I was not to say that, would you still rate and subscribe? I'll see you next time. Cheers.